Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Um, this is episode three of this playthrough. And we're just gonna get started. Something was transmitted from the top of the spire. I guess I have to find a way up there. Okay, let me scan this. There's nothing to scan. All oh, this. Is... Okay. Alright. Okay, so while I get up to here, we're gonna um. Have a quick recap of what happened last um, episode. Um, we let me get this real quick. <laughs> um, we managed to go to the data center and. The backup was not there, um, so uh, we returned to Meridian, and we about to see what's going on with this. Use my pull caster on that. Okay, use the pull caster. Yeah. Should be able to get up there now. Okay, guys, I have to double jump. Yeah. Silence was helping me when he gave me his lance. But it looks like he tricked me. He transmitted something through the spire. Did he save Hades? Why would he do that? Well, if I can figure out where he sent it, I can track him down. Hopefully the transmission note at the top will tell me. It looks like this panel's a jar. Can I go up through the inside? I see you finally figured it out. 
To be honest, I'm surprised it took you so long to discover my rules. You read the lands to steal Hades. How could you be so reckless? Reckless? You're the one who tried to purge Hades before its precious knowledge could be extracted. The mysterious signal that woke it, for example. But why don't take one of those Gaia backups you've been having such a hard time finding? If you knew, why didn't you just tell me? I've been having problems of my own these past six months, Leloy. The difference is, I've made progress. So once your anger at my entirely necessary deception has faded, now why don't you come out here and find me in the Forbidden West and learn all that I've discovered? Oh, I'll go find you, all right. Yes. Well, the coordinates should make it simple enough. Even for you. Okay. always has a way of doing the incredible. You went inside it and it transformed. Almost like the day of the battle. I can only be grateful that it's a stormy day. Few will have seen the tower change from Meridian. What did you discover? Hades. The danger didn't end here. It went into the Forbidden West. And I have to follow. I see. That can be difficult. The West is called Forbidden for a reason. A tribe of ferocious warriors controls much of it. The Tanakh, and they allow no trespassers past its border. That said, under the Sun King of Art, a fragile peace has been negotiated, and indeed, the next step on the edge of the frontier. Were you to attend the gathering under his auspices, the Tanakh might grant right of passage instead of hunting you and attacking on sight. Great, just what I need. More killers. Uh, the Sun King. Aloy, it's good to see you. You left in such haste. We never had a chance to properly thank you. Can, can we show the champion the spear now, please? It's a min. quiet. It's true. We bear gifts. Decorum usually calls for a ceremony of offering at the palace, but I thought you would prefer a less formal occasion. Bring them, please. Uh, Avad, this is all very kind, but I... Uthit, Vanasha. Quick, better hand them over before she runs off again. <laughs> really? Must you? Try it on. It's beautiful. On behalf of all the citizens of the Sundom, may these tokens remind you of our eternal gratitude. Perhaps you'd like to spend more time with your friends. Come speak to me when you're ready to depart. I need to attach the Master Override to my new spear. Should be a workbench around here I can use. I might go to the workbench. I think it's over there. Yeah, it's over there. Savior. There. 
The workbench. Thank you. <laughs> Spear upgrade. Master override installed. Plus, something new to store up and release energy. A uh, resonator. Should help in a fight. Buthid, Fanasha, thanks for being here. Wouldn't miss it. Even if you did leave us hanging after the big battle. Vanasha, stop. She's here now, isn't she? For the moment. But I see that look on her face. She's got business to attend to. And it isn't in Meridian. You know, I didn't vanish before because I wanted to. I had- No, Huntress. Please. You don't have to justify yourself to us. You saved our butts. If you've got to go, go. With our blessing. Always. Well, I, I know. I know. You're out. Go! Away with you. Always an honor, champion. Always a pleasure. But please, little Huntress, come back someday and tell us about your adventures. If I can't get in trouble, at least I can hear about yours. Okay. So I am eager to go to the Favelin West. So I think I'm just gonna go right ahead and talk to um them. Aloy, are you finished with your friends, or do you need more time? Time to go. I better get going. And if I'm headed west, it sounds like I'll need rite of passage from the Tanana. Where exactly is this embassy going to be held? Past the Daunt, the canyon that marks the western border of the Sundom. You'll find the fortress of Baron Light at its farthest edge. The embassy will take place just beyond its gates. It's a long march, a fortnight on foot. A couple of days hard riding should get us there. Actually, it might be better to rest here tonight. Head out in the morning. Of course. I'll arrange it. So yeah, I am having a lot of um, technical difficulty. And I'm so sorry about that. Is she really leaving? I think she is. Oh, that sucks. I'm gonna skip this part. Is that how I get to Baron Light? Uh, yes, I mean, usually, but not today. Uh, not yet. And why is that? Well, the Daunt. The whole valley. It's infested with machines. Uh, 
I can handle machines. Oh, I'm sure you can, but uh, I'm under strict orders not to operate until the whistle down at Chain Scrape sounds the all clear. Look, I didn't come all this way just to stand around and wait. I'll crank that car down myself if I have to. Well, but then who would crank it back up? <laughs> fine, fine. Though, should anyone ask, it might be best to say you forced me. <laughs> Level it's three. Smoke. Really? Of activity. Smoke's probably coming from something the machines wrecked. As for the quiet, well, there's a work stoppage in effect because to of the brain. all the fuss. What sort of machines are causing the trouble? Nasty ones and lots of them. Bristlebacks, they're called. The strangeness is, they're not native to the Daunt. Just showed up, all of a sudden. No hunters to kill them? Well, we've got hunters, just none that want to cross Olvent. Boss of Chain Scrape. He is self-appointed. Work stoppage was his idea. Yeah, well, I'm just passing through. Got an embassy to attend. You should have said that ain't gonna happen no time soon. What are you talking about? Hear that? That's your answer. Who is that? Karja Sun Priest. We cranked him down yesterday, about an hour before the machine trouble started. He's a very important man, or so he says. That embassy at Baron Light, he's the one supposed to run it. You don't do as I say immediately. The Sun King himself shall hear of your insolence. Thanks to you, I was forced to spend the night shivering in the tent. Exposed to attack, I might have died. Oh, me you refuse to transport, but not this... This... What? This Nora girl? This savage? Besides Scallywag? Wadis. That's Aloy. Studious Wadis. Aloy? You know, savior of Meridian? Really? Well, that lessens the insult, I suppose. I came here for the Embassy of Baron Light. The way I hear it, so did you. Well, not with the valley infested. And so did Aramon proclaim the Sun Priests most precious and worthy of safekeeping. See, Scripture. I shall head to Baron Light when the captain of the Vanguard tells me the way is clear, and not a moment sooner. Fine. Captain's a friend of mine, you know? Where is Erend? Wouldn't mind speaking to someone a little more action, a little less scroll. Vadis. Studious Vadis. <laughs> Studious Vwadi sent Aaron and another vanguard out at daybreak to clear the way. And so at daybreak... Hey! Shh. Down the valley then? Yeah. <laughs> Said they check the ruins on the left bank for tracks. Take it from there. Okay. I hear there's a work stoppage. Any way to upgrade my gear? I'll bet the smith and chain scrape would let you use his workbench. As for the bristlebacks, you might want to craft some acid arrows. Hitting their canisters with those will take them down quick. Thanks. I'll find Aaron and I'll bring him back. Hey! Where do you think you're going? What? To the top of the ridge. To wait in safety. Sorry. Operator's under strict orders. No passengers till the whistle blows, right? That's right. <laughs> Best start cranking. <laughs> Why? Why? Jorf, would you kindly escort Studious to chain scrape and wait for me there? You got it. I will find Erend, and I will help clear a path. But after that, no more excuses. Baron Light. Embassy. If such be the will of the sun, 
It will be. Trust me. All right. I gotta find Errand. But I think it might be good to hit chain screen first and upgrade my bow. We get these three items. Okay, one more. It seems like she's very like like straight straightforward. Um I like it. This is our first fire uh, campfire. I'm gonna do a menu save. Okay, we have what three machines there? Yeah, seems like. We have three machines. Um, I think I'm just gonna go to stealth kill them because it was easier <laughs> to do that. goes one where's the other one I'll have to find a cauldron out here to learn how to override that alright let's see if we can See if we can do that one. Somebody's looking at me. All right, let's get this one first then. For a lot of them, I can't. Crap. Still miss. Damn it. Where is he at? Oh, yeah. Hey, he goes on the ground. Sucks. There you go. So eventually I want to explore all this area I just want to like get into camp so I can have a stopping point there um, but next episode what I'm gonna do is just explore this area a bit and see what's out there Oh, this is another pig. 
Like crap. Okay, I'm done. Let me get this. green thing oh it there I'm gonna go get it green shine silver it's green like blaze but it's hard and shiny I wonder if merchants would be interested okay you have found a piece of green shine uh, a rare and valuable resources. It's a dead machine. It must be a bristleback. Maybe errand. That must be Jane's grave. Jeruf said I could get my bow upgraded in there. Might be able to tinker with my other gear too. Savior? Wanna come in, Savior? Of course, sir. Welcome to Chainscrape, Savior. Open up, guys. Dwarf's orders. Good enough for me. By the forge. Petra! Petra? Aloy, what are you doing here? Uh, about time there was something worth looking at in this dump. It's nice to see you too. And not a moment too soon. Come on. I... Damn brewery's the only thing I can count on in this place. Yeah, I heard. Machines, work stoppage. Oh, those are just the latest malfunctions. Chain scrape's always been a few tools short of a kit. And right there is the biggest tool of all. Our land, not our problem. The bristlebacks are everybody's problem. Roland? You've heard of him. Yeah. But he's a story. Best told over a cold beer. Uh, Petra, Petra. I'm just passing through. I'm headed west. Oh. There's an embassy at, at Baron Light I need to make happen, and then I keep moving. Ah, of course. Bigger gears to grind. Well, Flame Hair, good to see you. You gotta move on. Petra. But if you want a cold beer and a few laughs with an old friend, come find me at the brewery. Your choice. No. Feel bad. <laughs> Well, this old one guy sounds like trouble. Maybe Petra could use some support. But first things first, I need to find that workbench and upgrade my bow. Okay, this is a great stopping point, so I'm gonna stop right here. Um, if you like this video, leave a like. And if you want to see more videos like this, subscribe. And I'll see you next time. Bye!